Okay, so now it's on to next sample, next detail. So now we need to start the samples from document drawings number six. It has only two details, one page. So we will start from the first one. Okay, let's use our skills to build this detail faster, easier and using maximize our abilities ok, open AutoCAD, start drawing let's put our detail to there first of all we need to build the bigger the size dimension as you can see it's 100 millimeters this radius let's build it So go with hundred millimeters to lines. Radius is hundred. So let's put here to right side like this. Maybe quite maybe here like this. Done. If you if you want to change the scale you can change. Okay, now I want to sample here it's not so big okay. rotation no rotation ok done as you can see it's quite similar we, we can read so I want to start with this the upside of our detail <coughs> so as you can see it consists of the biggest uh, circle here the diameter is like uh, 94 millimeters the smaller one in the middle 40 uh, 54 millimeters and then the circle with central line is as you can see diameter is 74 so what will we do let's build it first of all let's start from the biggest one the diameter right diameter is 20 uh, 94 millimeters the next one 54 millimeters oh sorry we need to choose we need to choose diameter and then the circle with center line diameter is 74 millimeters like so again this mistake diameter is 74 millimeters so let's put central mark first that will be nice now what will we do is let's build the smallest circles and then we will copy them as you can see the diameter is like 12 millimeters and 6 holes so the radius will be 6 millimeters like this so now we can copy them in six time or you can we can use the array tool from here let's put here also the center mark now we can copy them choose select uh, center mark and circle together now we can use array tool select center six times Done. you can just press enter Done. so now we need to change type of this circle the middle circle to center Done. as you can see it looks nice little bit we finished with upper side of our detail what will we do is like we need to go down I will I want to build this side the bottom side of our detail and then we will connect them together so as you can see we need to build the, here like two circles small circles and we need to connect them together so we need if 
we want to p find center of this circle we need to build the circle with 100 millimeters the radius is 100 millimeters let's build it 100 millimeters done so what will we do with we need to uh, build extra line helpful line uh, with the angle 30 degrees let's build it choose line tool the starting point center of these circles we need to go to let's turn off the ortho mode we need to put as you can see we are putting angle of the opposite side so that's why we need to put 60 degrees and then uh, we can get 30 degrees in the opposite side 60 degrees so just press tab and then we can go down as you can see we will put it 130 millimeters now I want to copy it with using mirror tool enter so connection of these lines will be center of these smaller circles let's check dimension here the bigger one is 23 millimeters the smaller one is uh, radius with uh, 12 millimeters let's pull that let's pull smaller one first 12 millimeters the bigger one is 27 millimeters done if you want to build build in this side also if you want to copy just copy done so now we need to connect them how we connect them if you want to use fillet it's quite hard to use fillet tool here so i want to use uh this scale uh, i will build the circle which is center of these circles uh, and which ends first here and another one the outer side done as you can see we almost finished our mm, our way to fi uh, build this uh, figure here so let's build the inner circles also here one two as you can see it's a little bit complicated so we can solve it with trim tool just we can trim all of them the unnecessary things in this side also this side so we need to delete extra lines from inside it also i don't like this choose trim tool Richmond tool. I need to delete these ones. This one, this one. We don't need to delete the central line. Be careful because we need to change type of it's necessary for us. So just delete these ones. sorry I made a mistake like this be careful when you are trimming the extra lines again I'm doing same mistake done I think it's finished and then here we need to look our detail and then we need to trim these places can see we finished with this side we need to change the type of this line to center line because it's center line as you can see if you want to extend it a little bit just extend it don't change the angle of just extend in the same position so what we need to do is just uh, connect this circle and this figure so as you can see distance is 36 millimeters we need to build here like line uh, to left side 18 millimeters to right side also 18 millimeters 
what I want to do is I want to start building the line like this and then just using offset tool choose offset tool and then I need to put to the left side 18 millimeters now just if you want to copy it just copy it with mirror tool if you want to use mirror offset tool use it again how like this choose line again choose two points and to right side 18 millimeters done so using trim tool to delete extra line be careful I'm sorry see it here is the mistake also and zoom out the maximum you can delete it when you know this kind of stuff I hope no from the bottom one again so what now what will we do is just using fillet tool we need to build fillets here the upper side is like 10 millimeters the downside is 9 let's start with 10 millimeters like this from upside like this for downside the radius will be 9 so hmm As you can see, we are destroying our figure like this. So what will we do is let's increase this one. This. So now, I think we can use. No, we cannot use. I think. <laughs> what will we do? Let's do this operation. You know the radius is nine. Radius nine. No, I think we cannot copy it. No, let's do it. We can just build another circle like this using fill it tool again and then we can trim unnecessary line as you can see it's almost finished don't forget type to change the type of these two lines also if you want to change, select all center marks, center lines, like this. And just change the color. Done. If you want to change this one, so, so just select them and change. And just change. I think there is no mistake here. We finished our window, but don't forget delete this extra line and then increase this center line until down of our detail. Done. Decoration with dimensions is your task. So good luck with this. Thank you for attention again.